Hi everybody. Today we're going to have a look at how teachers can utilize touchback when presenting or sharing content up to the big screen using Miracast. Touchback makes an interactive display an extension of your personal device. Whatever you do up on the big screen will be reflected on your Windows computer or Android phone or tablet and vice versa. If you're using a Windows computer, hold the Windows key down and press P. You can choose to either duplicate your screen or use Airtame as an extended desktop. So, select Duplicate. You can then find your Airtame in the list that pops up, or you can type in the name of the device. Don't forget to tick the Allow Touchback box. You can now easily switch between slides. You can zoom in on a map or image. You can even go through a quiz to test your students on class material. To stop presenting, click Disconnect. You can also use touchback when sharing via Miracast to an interactive projector. Epson projectors are widely used in classrooms, and this model comes with a wireless pen that you can use for both touchback and annotation. To use touchback with a Samsung device, swipe down from the top, select Smart View, find your Airtame, and press Start Now. All you need to get started is an Airtame 2 device and either a micro USB to USB A female or micro USB to USB B cable. Log in to your Airtame Cloud account to enable Miracast on your Airtame. Miracast functionality, including touchback, is available at no additional cost. In each of these scenarios, you have the freedom to move around the room device in hand while wirelessly sharing class material. And at any point, you can put down your computer or mobile device, go up to the front of the room and control your class using touchback.